Hello again. We're coming at you from Peace, Love, and Vans, a huge van festival, probably the largest van festival in southeastern United States. You guys probably know this guy. He's a YouTube Hi, star. Everybody. We're having a great time here. <laughs> I, I'm never good with the microphone. I know. We need to wait. <laughs> <laughs> this is kind of ad hoc. So we're coming at you live streaming. So uh, thanks for watching that. We got a big pause. I'm just going to spin around. Can everybody say hello? Yay! A lot of embassy customers and wannabes. So what we want to do is, is Terry's going to walk us through this van. And Terry, I think what's kind of cute is you brought your cabana. We brought the cabana. It's a hit at every show when we do bring it. And it's just a great way to expand a, a vehicle that travels easy and gives you a great addition to the vehicle. And this is how you and I met it in is. January 2019 because you had this on a ProMaster van. I'm like, what in the world is this thing? Yeah. And, and this started Scott, everything. He kept bugging me and bugging me until I said, okay, I'll show you what it is. <laughs> he interrupted his yeah. lunch. Yeah. Um, so we're going to ask Terry to do, he's a VP at Embassy RV. And what makes Embassy RV so amazing is that there's no wood, no propane, no solar, no black tank. Did I say no, no mold, wood? No mill. No mood. No kidding. And 14 H below zero true. <laughs> and you know, we don't just no say shenanigans. Four season. No it's, dealers. It's tested 14 below zero. Yeah. And um, HOA friendly, which is pretty cool. Yeah, absolutely. So we're gonna have I'm gonna show you the, the, the floor plan right here. So I'm gonna spin this around. Stand by. Look at this handsome group. It's so great. I love this. <laughs> now they're quiet. Ooh. <laughs> oh. Woo! <laughs> Nothing like having a live audience. Do you feel like Phil Donahue or hey. Oprah show? So again, this is a cabana. We're gonna step in here in a second. Terry, this kind of shows what we're looking at before we get in here. So this is the cabana. Yes. This is on a ProMaster. And you guys build on all three uh, platforms. We do, and that's what it shows up here. So we build the Sprinter van, the ProMasters, and the Transits. Um, we build all kinds of vehicles, but those are the, some of them. Um, this is the Dolphin S floor plan. This is still our number one. So it's a very open concept floor plan with the Labio dry flush or composting toilet and just a completely wood free vehicle that can't mold or mildew or cause any issues of those kinds. So it's something we're known for. And I'm kind of pointing to those because there's you know some things that kind of folks expect. One thing that is not expected is you guys have a super powerful lithium system that comes standard. Actually, and that's a big deal. Actually that is Last old year's now. last year's model, so it's even better now. Standard is now 920 amp hour. Holy cow! That so is yeah, it's super super powerful. Super now. super powerful, and we'll probably demonstrate the TV pulling down out of the uh, yeah. out of the ceiling. So it's pretty great. We had the 920 as an option all these years, but everyone was picking it. I sold one or two 630s, so we said we might as well make it a standard. You know, everybody wants it anyway, so it's now a standard. Not standard. All right, let's look at this cabana. This thing is pretty cool. So it kind of tell us what we're looking at. It's really unusual in the van space. I, I created this because, you know, the vans are a little bit small for some folks. So the cabana is a composite platform that we created that stows away inside the vehicle and you close the doors that we hide behind these waterproof covers and you don't even know it's there. When you're driving down the road, the cabana and the canopy is inside the vehicle. So it takes about five minutes to stow it away. Five, I put it out and put it up five minutes in the dark last night. You <laughs> By know. yourself. So it's very easy to do. Um, so it comes with steps and what, keep going. This is a custom stairway we made out of aluminum that folds up and stows in a custom pouch. And this handrail comes off and it stows between the cabana and the wall. So it's very easy to stow. And when you come in, Scott, you can see, you can sit down. There's a lot of room. There's plenty of room to travel through. It's just a great space that has privacy window, clear window screens. You get your choice on the sides. So if you want total privacy back here, it is. I mean, you can change back here. You can take a shower back here. It does all that. Or you can sit here with the clear windows down and have a beautiful view or open. Folks. Step in first. Um, yes. So maybe just kind of give us the approximate size of this, to, just to give folks a sense of. Um, and again, this is on the back of the van. This is what's so stunning, van, right? Basically, is as large as we can make to fit inside the doors with the composite. So that so was my next question. Where does this it thing holds fit? It a full-size air mattress, so it is additional sleeping. You know, in most of our vehicles, we have seat belts. Uh, we're going to have it in the ProMaster before too long. Um, they're going to get us a body in white soon, so that's a wonderful thing. Yeah. Let's go ahead. So. You can set chairs back here. You can put air mattresses back here. You can make a play area for the kids on a bad day back here. You know, 
we do that with our grandchildren and it's just an amazing space. Let's follow you in because it's really cool. Let's go in. So a couple steps in. And you can sit with plenty of room. I have a fan going back here just for some added ventilation and you still got plenty of room with two people sitting in here. You can set four chairs. A little bit of lighting maybe. <laughs> there is lights back here. Yeah. So Put some mood lighting. Up. Again, if it's inclement weather or just need some extra space, you want to maybe separate yourself from inside the van from somebody else in, in there. I've been in severe storms. We're going to have rain all day tomorrow. So we created these from the Tampa Super Show. We had a torrential rain there. This keeps it from puddling on the roof and makes the water oh, shed off. Yeah. So those work beautifully. So like a fiberglass to it. rod that kind of gives some... Uh, it just keeps it taut. Taut, yeah. It's but really cool. We'll use an Austin Powers word there, taut. <laughs> And it kind of just affixes to the um, the van here. We have electrical back here. We've got um, wonderful storage tracks we put in. This is an option we offer that everybody loves for shelving and different things to mount. And okay, stepping step, into the van, what are you we stepping into this here? This is actually the changing area, the shower, and the restroom. So we can get some cards here. This lifts up and it's actually your restroom area too. We have a handicap bar available now. Nice. So we just created. And, and this turns from a restroom into a nice, beautiful changing area, but it's also your shower pan. Shower drape comes around and it's a beautiful big shower. And again, what we're looking at is marine vinyl, marine plastic, no wood. Everything's extruded aluminum, right? It's Cabin wrapped tree? around a plastic core aluminum that's made for sign material outside, so nothing can mold, no do a rod or a warp or Shower pan, so there's your drain. And Terry, yeah. the, the toilet, you guys don't have any black tanks. Like we, no black tank, this is the labial dry flush. Labial dry flush. So it's like a diaper genie, so it's you use your thing. It's a diaper genie on steroids, yeah. we call We have a beautiful custom mirror that comes out. We can actually make it go brighter and dimmer with the touch of a button. We can change colors. So this is really nice. We can turn it off and on, go back and mount to the wall. That's so great. Plenty of storage everywhere. And these are both storage. We so have a wardrobe, linen closet. Vitrifrigo 12 volt refrigerator storage above it. And then we get into the beautiful galley area. Yeah. Turn on a couple more lights. Huge sink. Huge sink, huge new faucet that adjusts its flow oh, without doing a pull out. That's cool. There's too much going on underneath of these vans to try to do pull out. Yeah, it makes total sense. <laughs> it just works better. Pantry, beautiful big pantry. I can open the bottom like this. Oh, with pull-out drawers. Look at all the food it's capable of holding. I'm coming over here for it's dinner. It's stocked. <laughs> I know, this is so great. And I think it's, it's a soft close too, right? It's all soft So close. you kind of push it in and it just yeah. pulls back in. Just And I love this idea here. It's this so underutilized. Yeah, it holds for, coffee pots. It holds Toilet paper, fryer, potato you chips. Just, it. it's, you just it'll, cram it'll, it. It'll stow it up Bedding. There. Maybe if you've got yeah. the kids out here, grandkids for air mattress, you can put your bedding here. Uh, just so, so lovely. Microwaves, more storage. I tried to dress this up a little bit. We put the splash of red in here. Remember the whiskey wagon had the splash oh, yeah. of blue? Yeah. So I threw red in this one. This is a beautiful red. <coughs> so I threw a little bit of color in with it. Yeah. You know, this is just bedding, but I wanted to show what you can do with color. It's really nice. Then kind of the dark gray. So you have a lot of combinations of colors that yes. you can, that can yes. do. Yes, um, And Terry, we're not going to be able to demonstrate tonight, but uh, we'll probably do another video uh, standalone. But right. These, so two we, twins, or they come together, is that right? Power and there's that So one power there. sofa. You so just if you stop need a, it where you want, you can go three inches, four inches, all the way, you know, whatever you want. So if space. you just want a little more shoulder room, but don't want to block the alley way, and hallway. And powers right back in. So awesome. Um, we're going to demonstrate what's above your head in a second, but let's talk about AC and lithium. This we talk about lithium outside. Italian what is air conditioner. All right. This is 120 volt. Oh. You don't hear me say that a lot. Oh. It's so efficient. It's a air conditioner and a heat pump. That's cool. So it'll give you heat or cool. And it's running right now. You can't really hear it. It's it'll turn totally off. If I had the doors closed, it wouldn't be running at all right now. It's pretty quiet. Because it shuts totally off and the compressor is so efficient, this will run over 20 hours on our 920 amp hour battery. Wow. That is unheard of for air conditioning. And it's really low profile on the inside. It's very, very cool air conditioner. We've been using them on Salvation Army vehicles we build, and they did so well, we introduced it to the RVs. 
So you do a lot on transit, um, some on Sprinter, Ram ProMaster. Tell us why a Ram ProMaster might work better for some folks. The ProMaster's gone through some retooling, and I wanted to drive this down. I was going to bring my kayak with my twin 86-pound trails trolling motors, and I couldn't get myself to tow a trailer because I wanted to see how this did. This thing was amazing to drive, I have to tell you. We put Sumo Springs on it. It was so stable, Scott. It tracked beautifully. It was a soft ride. It was easy to steer. It had plenty of power. I was really, really impressed with the ride of this ProMaster. Uh, they did a great job in 2023 and 24. And you mentioned the transmission's a big improvement. It's a nine-speed transmission. It handled the mountains beautifully. I had plenty of power. They told me it wasn't the engine's weakness on the older ProMasters. It was the transmission, and that nine-speed proved that it, it did and it sounds very throaty, I might add. When you get on it, it sounds a little bit sporty. Yeah, I, I, the transmission is yeah. terrible on mine. Um, Terry, demonstrate for us, please, if folks aren't aware of this. So a lot of folks like to watch TV in, in their van. What is this? How big is that? Yeah, we watch. That's a 28-inch TV. It's all I can fit in here. The transits have a 32-inch, by the way. But it's a beautiful TV for the space of this vehicle. We watched a movie last night with uh, that was incredible. Uh, Tom Hanks movie that I never knew existed. <laughs> He's a cowboy kind what? of thing in it, or preacher cowboy, and so it was a beautiful. It wasn't movie Toy Story, was it? <laughs> no, yeah, just kidding. Um, it's really pretty. So let's put that up and just show folks how that easily. That's it. It's the only van I've ever seen with that implementation. It's all mechanical. I created it to be gas struts that hold it in place. We have rotary latches. There's a strap here that I pull that drops it. So it's super easy to drop. You just oh, yeah. pull the strap and it releases the rotary latches from the pins. And you got a super stable TV going on the road that you can watch from back here. And you can put the bolster pillows up and lean them and it's a chase lounge. It's just yeah. the most comfortable way to travel. It's true movie night in a van, yeah. which is pretty and amazing. And when you're done, it just stows away. And that's the kind of engineering Embassy is famous for, just we solving a problem that isn't the obvious way and that takes some R&D and some engineering to make that happen, right? I worked with power drops and they were so lazy because you could only do one power section of it that this just turned out to be the best way to go. It's so great. Let's um, step outside. Let's just look outside real quick. So I think... we have new running boards. We have more ground clearance because of them. We have new lighting under the running boards. Oh, laser cut. So nice job. we reinvented job. all of our running boards to give us more ground clearance than we ever had before. And We've got a nice brush guard on the front. What? A beefy one. You're getting With a driving light, off-road light on it. Watch your... Uh... So I'm having a little fun with that. What I want to show people is how gonna... stealthy this is compared to, I don't know, something like this. And this is what makes an embassy RV very You're seeing my HOE friendly. Mic rack here That's stuff. okay. Um, yeah. So again, nothing really gives us away. Maybe the AC, but it could be like a catering van, right? But again, it's there's there's no very few cutouts, if any, just the power. Absolutely, it's uh, very it, stealthy. You see the scuffers, and you know it's an embassy. It's our trademark. I've got other builders that are trying to buy the venting system from me. I said, no, that's a trademark embassy. Sorry, you don't get that. <laughs> <I know. laughs> and what he's talking about is the um, is the uh, this the, one's the, hidden behind the door, but it's that one over the there. The scuffer right here. So this there's is part of the here. the ventilation system. Yeah, this is a good angle. So again, no awnings, no solar. Nothing that really gives away that's an RV. Uh, this is so great. We got a big posse out here watching us. This is great. <laughs> I know. We've got over 40 vans here. We're probably pushing 50 of our customers attending really? this event. It's this a great family. You'll see. Spin this around. Everyone loves doing things together. It's just a wonderful thing for us to be a part of and see as well. And it's kind this of this lifestyle is amazing. Yeah. And that's what this shows. That's what this shows. And I think that's, you know, the van's important, the floor plan's important, but it's really where it takes you and the people you meet. And this has just become an incredible family, right? And I, I just can't say enough about that. You know, you see that, you get to mingle with all these people as you travel, and it's just a wonderful, wonderful lifestyle to be able to do as we get to the retirement age and get to spend some time to do things that we want to do. Yeah, it's truly great. Let's look, um, so we're going to end this here in just a second. Let's spin this around so you guys can say hi. No, 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 no. hi. Embassy RV! Hey. <laughs> we're cutting into happy hour. So, so who's got a YouTube channel, Roads of Life? So Roads of Life on YouTube. Uh, 
Joy in route. Joy in route on YouTube. Who else? Maury Vans. What? Yeah, Maury Vans. <laughs> dog named Hondo. Um, and Maury Vans. I don't see him here, but uh, they're, not here. they're not here. Okay. Uh, this was very important. Um, very cool. So Terry, just thanks again for your time. Uh, come. I think there's still day passes available here. Oh, the camping is all sold for out. For Sunday, I believe. For Sunday. Thank you for the Saturday clarification. Um, where can people learn more at uh, about Embassy RV? Uh, EmbassyRV.com. <laughs> and go small, live large. And go small, live large. Yes. So it, go small, live large. It takes you to embassy.com. <laughs> it does. RV .com. And uh, let them know that you found out uh, through me, uh, Scott Watson, or go small, live large. It helps him uh, put his marketing dollars to you. So again, it's just a delight having you here. Your second year. Yes. I w actually, I wasn't going to attend this last year. The customers were here in person and said, you got to come. They so I did, and we have so much fun here. It's just an amazing event. Yeah, so, it's uh, going to be. There's over 500 vans here. It's just, are you judging this year? Are you, I am. Are you really? Ooh. I was not. I was very nervous last year. I'm not so nervous this year. <laughs> I know what it's about now. You're going to be gentle but firm on the, the judging. The folks that won my road just came by and said hi a few minutes ago. Oh, that's really cute. nice to see them. <laughs> They're warming up the panel. Yeah. <laughs> that is so great. Terry, thanks for all you do for the community yeah, and for the way you do that. things. It's just so great. Uh, we got more lo YouTube lives coming out all weekend long, so I don't want to miss a single minute of that. Watch for it. Subscribe to the channel because when we go live, you get a notification from YouTube. That's super great. And just, just an honor being your partner again for our fifth year, I think, right? Yeah. And uh, we got some really cool stuff, including yeah. Sunshine State. RVs are working with you guys. We're going to make They're that a big an announcement. Amazing job helping Next. customers when they need help. Yep. And, and then yeah. uh, Embassy RV is going to be sponsoring some of our Van Breeze campouts, Van Breeze, I call them. So, just again, thanks for your continued yeah. support of yeah, me, so my cool. mission, and our collective family. It's just it's so great what we do. Um, all right, folks, until we see you soon, we say peace be with you, and we'll see you soon. Thank you. <laughs>